as usual, Christina Kaunda here. Um, so today's video is dubbed as easy ways to pray. Why am I sharing this video? I feel um, every time people get discouraged, from time to time people get discouraged to pray, distractions come on and you know, before you know it, you used to pray once a day, now you don't even pray at all. Okay, so uh, the first point is, first of all, keep it short. Keep your prayers short. Why am I saying this? I'm not saying long prayers are not so good. In fact, long prayers are amazing. Short prayers, amazing too. But the 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 more you keep them short, the more you enjoy. The more you want more and more and more. And in the end, if you started with five minutes, you find yourself doing ten minutes. Before you know, thirty minutes, one hour, and you're like, oh my goodness, I actually had an awesome time spending. Uh, you know with God so keep them short eventually you're gonna you know it's, it's gonna be long then the second point is pray anywhere don't postpone prayer sometimes God gives you the feeling to pray Sunday says you pray 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 and you're like no I have to go to my prayer room when I get home no pray now you can pray anywhere that is why we have access to God we're not waiting for, to to go to one altar or one prayer room or one pastor, one prophet, you too can pray anywhere. Pray for yourself. Pray anywhere. You're yeah, yeah, yeah. at work. You can pray, God help me. What do I do? What do I do today? Maybe you're in the market. You will be in school. You will be just taking a walk. You can pray anywhere. I'm not saying you pray in places well. you know, you could be in danger like you're crossing the road and something happens. See, please be careful. Don't do that. But you can pray anyway actually so um yeah then the next point is uh use a song you could sing a song or you could uh you know you could go on youtube or you play a song from your phone a christian song of course that praises and worships god you're praising and worshiping him there are even songs that petition things on your behalf you know i'm gonna wait on you you know like you can just uh, as you're singing you know it's it's like a prayer like like uh, like a reassurance to say God will always be by my side. God will always provide. Then the next one is the Bible verse. Use the Bible verse to pray. There's so many verses, so many promises of God in the Bible. For example, uh, may not really look, sound like a promise, but talk about love being love is patient, love is kind. You could say I'm kind. I am patient. You know, maybe maybe you had a rough day and, and all those things and. You didn't act well, you could go back and pray. You could use the Bible to pray, or you could use the, the full armor of God. You say, I have the breastplate of righteousness, I have the, the, the helmet of salvation, I have the belt of truth, I have sandals ready to spread the gospel, I have the word as a sword, faith as a shield. You know, you are also you are studying the word at the same time praying to God, praying and reminding yourself of who you are in God. Okay, then um, another easy way to pray is to journal. Every prayer, you know, like for me, I have the journal here. I have it right here. It's, don't mind this. It's not a, a novel or anything. It's actually uh, a notebook. I always write. I think I've reached half now. You know, I have like five, ten of these. I don't know, somewhere in my suitcase. But I, I like writing my prayers. And why? Because whenever God answers my prayer, I go back to them. Because uh, we tend to forget what we prayed for at some point and God answers and we don't even realize that God is answering our prayers And once you have this, it's a record of of you and God It's like evidence, um, like physical evidence of your relationship, okay, aside from you know, your life and all Like it's, it's like a secret thing between you and God where you can go through You could have several books, maybe a book for your spouse or a book for uh, I have one for my spouse, I have one for my kids, and I just have one person, one for me and God. So nice I may mix them up, but I, I have this. And every time I go back when I'm discouraged, I say, God, you did it before, you can do it again. I asked for this on this thing and you did it. So, like, have a notebook. And sometimes talking may be, you're talking and talking, you can just be writing. Write a prayer. God knows. God, even crying could also be a way of praying. So, there's so many ways to pray, okay? So, um... Yeah, I want to encourage you not to feel like, you know, you need like a specific way to do things. Of course, as you are getting better, you begin to improve yourself, you begin to go longer hours, or you, or you begin to have a separate room where it's just you and God, and that's fine. 
okay but if you don't have that room it's still okay you can pray 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 anyway mm -hmm. okay then uh an another quick one just to conclude easy ways to pray you could also to encourage yourself in these ways is to have someone accountable you know to you or set reminders you maybe you can set at 8 a.m or 10 a.m or noon and and you know when those alarms come on you can just say god thank you for today i'm grateful that this day has been brought to me i'm alive you know in the afternoon you say god it's been amazing i know that challenge is here and there but i know you're here but i'm asking for this and even you can pray like it's just that and also um another thing is as you pray remember that communication is a two-way thing so as you talk you know that he wants to talk back to you so don't be quick to leave prayer even if it's five minutes, maybe maybe you pray for four minutes, the last four minutes you just stay in silence. Or even seconds, you stay in silence. Yeah, just listen to God. Sometimes, in, in the beginning, it may really be really, really, really weird. Or you may just not hear anything. Or maybe your inner voice, you're like, is this me or God? But as you practice, and it is, it is all about obeying. The more you obey, the more you know, like, obey God. And I'm not saying in the beginning, you like I said, you are gonna hear, hear <laughs> you're gonna hear everything. But with time, you begin to hear things like, "Wait, I didn't say that. I didn't even think that. How did that come? Don't, don't, don't think that's normal. Okay, don't think it's, it's a coincidence. No, begin to, you know, act on those things, and before you know it, you know, it's gonna be okay. So make sure you always hear back from God. It's gonna help you. So it's so easy don't make it work don't make it stressful god is gonna help you so thank you very much don't forget to like don't forget to share and subscribe bye for now